Well, my boobs are great for Playboy, but uh, they're not big enough for anime. <laughs> I might need a second boob job. I literally thought about it. I was like, my boobs aren't big enough. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I was like, yo, yo, yo. People do this for a living? Oh my, oh my goodness. I was so excited. I was like, well, I already model. I love playing video games. If I can make money on it, then I'm gonna do it. Oh my god, Kevin Jet! Kevin Jet! Kevin Kevin Jet! Holly Wolf is probably the queen supreme of Canadian cosplay. Hi guys, how's it going? What is up? I would say I was at a million likes or so on Facebook and when I started cosplaying and mixing Playboy and cosplay together, just being known for those two things, I, my social media kind of blew up even more so because it, it was rare for somebody to be doing both. But um, people, people are picky and mean just for the sexualization of it. There is no difference between cosplayer and sexy cosplayer because there are so many characters that are half naked or have skin tight clothing and it's like, okay, well those are considered sexy. Does that mean a cosplayer can't cosplay a character that is in nature drawn sexier? It doesn't make sense. There's no, there's no difference. My mindset is, all right, I'm gonna do something super sexy in latex. Okay, now I'm gonna do something that's pretty crafty. Like the whole thing lights up. If I can get it to light up. There you go. You have to constantly go back and forth because if you don't, then people will label you. Oh, boobs. That's all. That's all she's got. Okay, bye. This is um, an alternate version of Zero Suit Samus from Metroid. It's a Nintendo uh, video game. And this is a bathing suit version from Super Smash Bros. Sexier version. Being overtly sexy can be a, can be a huge issue. Even, even Fan Expo had, had not negative thoughts about me, but like, you know, they were unsure about me. It took them years to book me, because they're like, well, you were Playboy. I know some of my friends have been told to change sometimes. Um, some of the like sexier, sexier ones. The booby police came to my booth, and I got in trouble. And now, I'm kind of in a sweater. They were saying, you know, it's family friendly, which is crazy, because comic books and video games is comic books and video games. What's even weirder is the whole fact that we have to now have massive banners that say cosplay is not consent. Because girls that are sexually clad, all of a sudden that opens you up to being able to be touched or something. It's, it's, it's so caveman-ish. Aww, thank you. But it cons. Aww, yay. <laughs> sticky hug. I'm not sticky yet though. Yeah, I'm on hugs. Hugs everywhere. Oh, wow, you really like hugs. <laughs> They're a little bit, um, a little bit more, obviously. I just try to be as nice as possible and I don't, um, I don't know, if they say anything too snarky, then I'll be like, hey, but they were okay. They just wanted some really big hugs. 